Hello friends, we will be learning microprocessor 8086 program. These are the Mumbai University problems for the past years. First program is of addition of 32-bit numbers. To add 32-bit numbers, we first load the LSB of first number into AX register using move instruction. We then load the LSB of second number into BX register. We then add the two LSBs that is the content of AX and BX register using add instruction. We then load the MSB of first number into AX register at the different memory location and MSB of second number into BX register at a different memory location. For this addition, we will use ADC add with carry instruction so that if any carry is generated in the LSB addition, it will be added. The result is stored in AX and BX register. AX contains the LSB and BX contains the MSB after addition. Our second program is finding the smallest number in array of 10 numbers. Firstly, we are using SI register and loading it to 200. Then we assign CL register as 10 as we are giving 10 numbers as input. Then we are finding the smallest number so we compare with the highest sign number. Sign numbers are from minus 128 to plus 127. We compare with plus 127, that is 7F in hex. Now we use CMP to compare AL and the data in SI register. The next statement, jump less or equal, doesn't execute on first iteration. We then increment SI to compare with next input. Also, we decrement counter to read all 10 inputs. We use J and Z, jump if not zero. This statement check CL register. If it is zero, it moves to next statement. If it is not zero, it moves again to compare statement. So, comparison of all data input take place. Finally, we store the smallest number of all in data element 20A has 200 to 209 are the inputs we end with hlt to terminate our next program is finding the factorial of a number the number whose factorial we need to find is loaded in bl register initially al is given 0 1 as input now, using merge instruction, we multiply the content of AL and BL and store the result in AL register. So, initially, BL is 05H and AL is 01H. So, the result stored in AL is 05H. Now, we use DEC instruction to decrement the value of BL by 1. Now the value of BL becomes 4H. Now we have condition instruction J and Z jump if not 0. This will check whether the value of content loaded in BL is 0 or not and jump accordingly. So here the value of BL is 05H. Hence, it is not zero. Therefore, it jumps back again to the mul BL instruction. Now, the decremented value of BL gets multiplied with the current value of AL. So now, the result stored in AL register is 4 into 5 is 20 H. This iteration will go on until the value of BL becomes zero. Hence, we can compute the factorial of 5. Our last program is generating a square wave. We first use move instruction and load 80H in AL. We then use out instruction which, which allows port A as output port. We then initialize AL has 0 which is the first data for the DSC. 
we then use out instruction as it is the data given to port pins of 8255. We then use CX instruction and load it to 200. We then use loop instruction which is for delaying the time. Next instruction is XOR which is used for toggling the bits of air. Finally JMP which is jump is used for the infinite loop. So, so that's it guys, this is Saurabh Tirorko signing off, hope you like the video, please like and subscribe, thank you.